Warm greetings, globe trotters. Welcome back to our channel. This is a Ned Voyage presentation. Once again, we're here to fuel your wanderlust, this time by whisking you away to the enchanting realm of Scandinavia. At Ned Voyage, we're all about exploring the world without breaking the bank. And today, we're going to unveil the secrets of thrifty travel in this northern wonderland. So buckle up and get ready to discover new horizons. Today, we journey through the captivating landscapes of Scandinavia. Scandinavia, a region in Northern Europe, is a world filled with remarkable natural beauty and diverse cultures. Nestled at the top of the world, this captivating region comprises three countries, each with its unique charm, Norway, Sweden, and Denmark. Imagine the allure of the Northern Lights dancing across the sky in a mesmerizing display of nature's own theater. Picture the stunning fjords of Norway, where towering cliffs meet the tranquil sea, and let's not forget the bustling modern cities like Copenhagen, Stockholm, and Oslo, where ancient history meets contemporary design in a blend that's uniquely Scandinavian. It's a place where nature, culture, and history intertwine, creating a rich tapestry of experiences that are truly unforgettable. With that said, let's delve into the Thrifty Traveler's Guide to Scandinavia. Starting our countdown at number 10 is cycling in Copenhagen, Denmark. The city is a cyclist's dream, with over 400 kilometers of bike lanes. Cycling is not just a mode of transportation here, it's a way of life. You'll find locals and tourists alike, pedaling their way through the city's picturesque streets, regardless of the season. What makes cycling in Copenhagen even more special is its cost-effectiveness. Renting a bike for the day will cost you less than a round-trip ticket on public transportation. Plus, it's an eco-friendly way to explore Copenhagen's charming landmarks, bustling markets, and serene parks. You'll also find the city's bike-friendly infrastructure quite impressive. There are dedicated bike lanes, traffic signals for cyclists, and even bike parking lots, all designed to make your cycling experience smooth and safe. So, hop on a bike and let Copenhagen surprise you. At number 9, we have visiting the Stockholm Archipelago, Sweden. Picture this. Over 30,000 islands, islets, and rocks scattered across the Baltic Sea, each one offering a unique slice of Scandinavian beauty. The archipelago is easily accessible through affordable ferry services, making it a paradise for thrifty travelers. As you journey through the archipelago, you'll be greeted by stunning views of untouched nature, charming red and yellow houses dotting the landscape, and the gentle lapping of the sea against the shore. Each island has its own distinct character and culture, from the rustic charm of Sandum to the bohemian vibe of Moja. And the best part? You can explore at your own pace, spend a day, a weekend, or even a week hopping from one island to the next, immersing yourself in the tranquil beauty of this Scandinavian gem. Certainly a visit to Stockholm isn't complete without exploring its archipelago. At number 8, it's time to lace up your hiking boots for Norway's stunning fjords. Imagine being surrounded by towering cliffs carved by ancient glaciers, their rugged faces plunging into the deep, shimmering waters below. That's the majesty of Norway's fjords, a natural wonder that's been millions of years in the making. But the fjords are not just for looking at, they're also a hiker's paradise, with a network of free, well-marked trails that wind their way through this breathtaking landscape. Whether you're a seasoned walker or a casual stroller, you'll find a path that suits your pace. And as you climb higher, you'll be rewarded with panoramic views that stretch as far as the eye can see. Imagine standing on a mountain peak, the cool, crisp air filling your lungs as you gaze out over a vista of sparkling water and jagged rock. That's the thrill of hiking in Norway's fjords. A hike through Norway's fjords is a rewarding experience that costs nothing but effort. Moving swiftly through our countdown, we have a mix of attractions at number 7 to number 4. First up is the city of Malmo in Sweden. A haven for the thrifty traveler, Malmo offers a variety of free or low-cost attractions. One of the highlights is the Turning Torso, a twisting skyscraper that is a marvel of modern architecture. While you can't go up the building, it's an impressive sight from the ground. And don't miss out on the city's parks like Kungsparken, where you can relax and enjoy the Swedish nature. Next, at number 6, we have the charming city of Aarhus in Denmark. This city is home to the Aros Aarhus Art Museum, one of the largest art museums in Northern Europe. But the best part is the Your Rainbow Panorama, a colorful circular walkway on top of the museum, offering a 360-degree view of the city. 
And while there's a fee to enter the museum, the panoramic view alone is worth every penny. Coming in at number five, we're back in Sweden, this time in Gothenburg. This city is a paradise for thrift-minded foodies. Gothenburg boasts an impressive food hall, Stora Saluhallen, where you can sample a variety of local and international foods without breaking the bank. Don't forget to try the famous Swedish cinnamon buns. Finally, at number four, we have the breathtaking natural beauty of Iceland's Golden Circle. This popular tourist route includes three stunning locations, the Thingvellir National Park, the Gullfoss Waterfall, and the Geysir Geothermal Area. While it's a bit of a drive, the scenery alone is worth the trip. And the best part, it's completely free to explore. So there you have it, four budget-friendly destinations in Scandinavia that offer a wealth of experiences without the hefty price tag. These locations prove that you don't need to spend a fortune to have an unforgettable travel experience in this beautiful part of the world. Remember, Scandinavia is not just about its high costs, but also about its high-quality experiences. At number three, we recommend experiencing the sauna culture in Finland. Just as apple pie is to America, saunas are to Finland, a quintessentially Finnish experience that is deeply embedded in the national culture. With nearly one sauna for every two people, this Nordic country is truly a sauna nation. Saunas are not just a place for relaxation, but also a social hub, a venue for family gatherings, business meetings, and a space for contemplation and tranquility. Public saunas offer a cost-effective way to immerse yourself in this tradition. They are usually heated with wood and have separate or mixed sections for men and women. You can sit and sweat in the warm embrace of the sauna, then cool down with a refreshing dip in the lake or a roll in the snow depending on the season. So when in Finland, do as the Finns do. Enjoy a relaxing sauna. Our penultimate recommendation at number two is exploring free museums in Oslo, Norway. Oslo, the heart of Norway's rich culture and history, offers free entry to a variety of its museums. These museums are a treasure trove, where every corner tells a story of Norway's past and present. First off, the National Museum holds art, architecture, and design collections that date back to the Middle Ages. Then, there's the Museum of Oslo, which offers a fascinating journey through the city's history. For nature enthusiasts, the Natural History Museum is the go-to place, showcasing a wide range of fauna and flora. Lastly, the Armed Forces Museum exhibits Norway's military history, a must-see for history buffs. These free museums are not only a haven for those with a thirst for knowledge, but also a great way to save on your travel budget. Indeed, Oslo makes learning about Norwegian culture an affordable adventure. And finally, at number one, it's watching the mesmerizing Northern Lights. These ethereal lights, also known as Aurora Borealis, are a spectacle like no other. The sky becomes a canvas, with strokes of green, purple, and sometimes red, painting an unforgettable picture. It's a free natural spectacle that makes the journey to Scandinavia worth every penny. These lights are visible from late September to early April, but the most vibrant displays are typically from December to February. The darker the night, the better the view, so aim for a moonless night if you can. And remember, patience is key. The Northern Lights don't run on a schedule, but where to watch them? Well, Northern Norway, especially around the Tromso area, is a fantastic bet. Finland's Lapland region is also a prime spot, with many resorts offering glass igloos for an uninterrupted view right from your bed. Or venture to the remote areas of northern Sweden, where light pollution is minimal and the spectacle is often at its most breathtaking. Remember, every penny saved on your Scandinavian journey is a penny earned for your next adventure. There you have it, a thrifty traveler's guide to Scandinavia. From cycling in Copenhagen, sailing in Stockholm, hiking in Norway's fjords, to experiencing sauna culture in Finland and watching the Northern Lights, we've journeyed through 10 budget-friendly adventures. Scandinavia is not just a destination, it's an experience that's accessible to all, regardless of budget. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Ned Voyage for more intriguing content. See you next time. Bye for now.